All right, welcome to the very first episode of the Russell McLean Show. We are live here on Spreaker and iHeartRadio. Thank you so much for tuning in. I am your host, Russell Devin McLean. Got a great show lined up for you tonight. Got a great guest. I'm going to be talking with Mr. Joey Canyon from RFD TV's The Joey Canyon Show. We had a great conversation a couple of weeks ago, and I'm going to share it here tonight on the broadcast. And with all that said, I know a lot of you have been seeing a lot of changes going on as far as the Radio Random Network is concerned. Yes, it is still up and running. We're still sharing news from the entertainment industry. I decided to rebrand our Tuesday night broadcast, uh, formerly known as Backstage with Hashtag RDM, uh, because, well, there's too many shows out there with that Backstage name, and I want to be different, so I decided to call this show The Russell McLean Show. Now, we're still going to have pretty much the same format. We're still going to be going live every Tuesday night, 7.05 Central Standard Time. Uh, best way to keep up with all the updates and Everything that's going to be happening with us is to sign up for the newsletter. You can go to RadioRandomNetwork.com, and there's a box there. Uh, pretty soon, there'll be the RussellMcLeanShow.com. You'll be able to keep up with all of the uh, latest news and updates and upcoming interviews and so forth there as well. And uh, don't forget, you can subscribe to the show on iHeartRadio, Stitcher Radio. You can follow us on Google Play, and there's so many more platforms out there that we're on pretty much just uh google radio random network or the russell mclean show it should pop up or you can just do it the old-fashioned way and go to the radio random network.com look for the ways to subscribe to the show on there with all of that said guys before we get to the interview with mr joey canyon i want to send a big shout out to today's sponsors without them tonight's broadcast would not be possible i want to send a shout out to real estate with tanya For all your real estate needs here in the state of Louisiana, give Tanya Halford a call at 225-202-0657. That's 225-202-0657. And Jody's Music of Walker, Louisiana. Support your local musicians and shop local. Jody's Music there in Walker, Louisiana. That's where I go shop to get all of my musician needs taken care of. You can look them up on Facebook, and I will share all of his information in description and show notes for today's show. As I said a while ago, I'm going to be joined by Mr. Joey Canyon. Joey is a singer-songwriter, and he is the host of RFD TV's The Joey Canyon Show. He joined me a couple of weeks ago. We had a great conversation. And with that said, what I'm going to do right now is take a small break. And then when I return, I'll be talking with the one and only Joey Canyon. So stay tuned. We'll be right back. In the market to buy a new home? Or maybe you're wanting to put your home on the market. Contact real estate agent Tanya Halford. Tanya is a KDK Capital Regional Realty Partner and can assist you with all of your real estate needs. Contact Tanya today for your free consultation at 225-202-0657. All right, my guest tonight on Backstage with Hashtag RDM. He is the host of the ever-so-popular RFD TV series, The Joey Canyon Show. I'm talking to none other than the one and only Mr. Joey Canyon. How you doing, Joey? Hey, Russell, I'm great. Hey, thanks a lot for inviting me on your show. Well, I appreciate you uh, you accepting the invite. It's great to talk Absolutely. to you. And with all that said, first and foremost, I want to say congratulations on the renewal for the second season of the Joey Canyon Show. Oh, gosh, are we excited about that. Thanks so much. It's it's going to be really fun. Yes, indeed. It's one of my favorite shows on RFD TV, along with Larry's Country Diner and all the other great shows that uh, salute classic country music. Absolutely. We're all a big, happy family, uh, and I'm, I'm just privileged and, and proud to be a part of it. Yes, indeed. I know you got some exciting things going on over there, but real quick, Joe, if you can give us the rundown, where did the concept of the Joey Canyon Show come from? Oh gosh, you know, I was I was sitting on a on a couch at home, uh, Russell, about four years ago, and watching, you know, going through three hundred channels that that are offered on cable. I couldn't find anything out there, and I just threw my hands up and said, "Lord, can anybody produce a?" show that's entertaining anymore (laughs) you know and he said yeah i mean that's true and he and and i heard his voice he said you're going to do it he says you're going to do it and so that's how it started and i get okay well then what is it going to be but well i knew it was going to be country music and i go 
you know, I used to love, uh, you know, the Glenn Campbell Hour, a little bit of Hee Haw, and Dean Martin Show, and all of those great old variety shows. I'm going to put something together like that so people that still remember those shows will see something like that. And that's where the concept came from. And it, and it, and, and I wanted it to be traditional country music. So that's how, that's how the, the idea came. And that's how I chose to do it that way. Yes, indeed. Well, with that said, you, you, you're, you're not only the host of the Joey Canyon show, you're also a singer songwriter and uh-huh. you've been performing for, uh, a long time now. I mean, was music something that was a part of your household when you was growing up? Very much so, Russell. Um, I grew up, uh, you know, with the hi-fi back in those days. Uh, my dad would listen to everybody from, you know, uh, Marty Robbins to Hank Sr. to to those of the day. I mean, even the Tex Ritters and the Webb Pierces and so on. And then my mother... She liked to listen to Frank Sinatra and Dean Martin and Nat King Cole and, and and Tony Bennett. And so every other album that was on that stack, you know, the hi-fi, would be my mom's stuff, and then my dad's stuff, and then my mom's stuff, and my dad's stuff. So I, I guess you could say that it was semi-brainwashed into my head, <laughs> and that's that's what I came at. That's, what, that's how I sing now, is I'm just a country crooner and, and with all of those influences. Yes, indeed. Well, with that said, Joy, a couple of days ago, uh, news had come out that you'd signed a deal with Comcast Entertainment Television. Can you give us a little bit of insight on on that deal? Well, here's the deal, Russell. Um, Throughout the country, uh, the Joey Canyon show is is on Comcast uh, and also on Dish and DirecTV. but, But the Joey Canyon show was not on Comcast in Colorado. Now, that's where we shoot it. And I'm going, geez, this is just really ridiculous. And I was talking with a, with a buddy of mine at the studios uh, that uh, is a production manager there, and he goes, you know, you should, you should try to be on CET, which is uh, the call letters for Comcast Entertainment Television. I go, I'd love to be on that. I go, we're not here in Colorado on Comcast, everything else, but not that. Right. So uh, he made a phone call. And then the next day, I got on the horn with the head of that, and I said, we'd love to have you on, and so on. And so we cut a deal, and now we're on uh, two nights a week in Colorado. Um, And um, the show has just picked up uh, Colorado and Utah. So that adds another 1,250,000 viewers for the show. So I was just really really tickled you know so. oh, i can imagine i can imagine now the first season of the show you had you had many great guests from tg shepherd to t graham brown uh mm-hmm. jan free one of my favorite mr rex allen jr who has been on here a few times it was a great guest overall for me but i out of all of all the ones that can you narrow down one of your favorite uh most favorite interviews that you've had so far on the show <laughs> you know i'm not gonna take that baby <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you something. Um, there's some of the guests on the show the, of the first season that have become good friends of mine. One of them is T.G. Shepard. Uh, Ronnie McDowell is a special kind of person. But let me tell you, Russell, every single one of my guests was a complete joy to have on. And, of course, you know, in country music, they were first class. I right. mean, I mean, everybody from Doug Stone to Tillis to you name it. So to, for me to pick a favorite, I, I would say this: they're all my favorite. They're all they all my. I mean, I know how to play the politics, brother. But yes, indeed. <laughs> but but truly, and you know them all, and and that's what they are to me. They're just very special friends, and and I I'm just very grateful and very proud that they they wanted to come and be on my show, and they. And they've been so wonderful. They speak all kinds of good things about my show, and I'm very, very happy about that. Most definitely they do. And it's it's almost the same thing here with, with myself with this thing going, too. I mean, I've had uh, Ronnie McDowell on many times, T.G. Shepard, yeah. T. Graham Brown, all those guys. And, man, they're so appreciative. Of of uh, of, of and, and, and accepting an invitation to come and, and be interviewed, but really, you know, they don't know me from from Adam. Now you have uh, right. a little more clout than I do, but at the end of the interview, when when they when they talk to you as if you you've been a lifelong friends, man, that's like hitting a lottery, isn't it? 
Well, you know, I, I, I just treat people the way I want to be treated. And, and when you do that, uh, and you make them feel comfortable, because when my stars come in from Nashville or wherever they come in from, most of them from Nashville, I treat them first class. From the moment they get off that plane, they are treated by first class as they well should be. And and from by doing that, by the time they get to the studio, they're already thankful that they're treated like somebody again, like when they were on top. And, and to me, they're always on top. So by the time they no, get definitely. to me and I get to meet them and I get to talk to them in their dressing room, I set them at ease and let them know I'm just a regular old dude like them or gal, you know, and, and I'm... I'm by the time they get on the set and we start talking or, or they start playing, they are they're feeling like they're at home, and and that's the way I want to do it. And that's how that, we do that, it. That's important. And then with that said, Mr. Joy, do you have any advice you can give to any uh, anybody that would want to follow your footsteps as far as songwriting or being a broadcaster or, or a journalist or anything like that? Is there any? Uh, yeah, uh, uh, I would go us? back to school and take a vocational class and don't get in this business. No. <laughs> 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 a lot I'm of just person. kidding. I do. I, you know, I don't give advice, Russell, but I do give suggestions, and this is what I what I would do is, if you want to be in the entertainment business, be in the entertainment business. Learn everything about it from people that know more than you. Hang around people that are successful in the business, and don't ever stop thinking you can't do it. But always be trustful or truthful to yourself about what you can and can't do. Because if you don't make it as a singer, you might be able to make it as a singer-songwriter. If you don't make it as a songwriter, you might make it as uh, the host of, of a TV or radio show. If you don't make it at that, you can always make it somewhere in the business if you don't give up and you believe that the Lord that is with you will help you and you believe in yourself and that's the best thing I could tell you because that's what I do. That's what I did. Hey, Amen. I that's uh, that's some uh, words of wisdom there, my friend, and the words to live by. With that said, you have a before I let you go, you have a tour that's going to be coming out. Uh, you're going on tour really, really soon, correct? Well, I'll tell you that was the plan. Uh, my my agent Gerald Murray um, had us all planned out to do that, but then the hour show format came out, and guess what? Uh, you know, I'm in, Den I'm in Nashville right now, but I got to get back to Denver because we got to start planning our uh, exterior shootings uh, in Colorado and here in Nashville for the next season. So I don't even know how I can get out and do any <laughs> shows right now, and that's a good problem to have. So yes, indeed. I'm thinking, Congratulations yeah, on that, man. Thanks, Russell. But I think next year I'll I'll be plenty busy uh, with uh, with touring when I can. So. Well, you may not be able to get on tour until next year, but all your fans out there can pick up The Rhythm of Living, which is your latest album by Mr. Joey Canyon. You can go to joeycanyon.com, and you can catch The Joey Canyon Show every Friday on RFD TV. You can check your local listings for that. It's usually 8 p.m. Mountain Time. Is that correct, uh, Mr. Joey? That's right. You bet. All right, you can catch on Twitter and everything else. Just keep at joycanyon.com. Mr. Joy, it was an honor and a privilege, an honor and a privilege to talk with you uh, this evening here on the show. And um, I'll be watching second season as I did the first season. You are uh, one of the top shows on our DVR here at the Radio hey, Radio Network Studios, my friend. Well, you are a true joy to talk with. I appreciate you having me on. And whatever I can do to help you, you just let me know. I'll remember that, Mr. Joy. Thank you so much for calling in. We'll talk to you down the road, friend. God, God bless you, Russell. God bless you too, man. All right, brother. All right, Mr. Joy, we are good, friend. Oh, good, good. Well, and I truly mean anything I can do to help, you just let me know. I certainly will, Mr. Joy, and we'll be watching on that second season too, friend. Hey, thanks, Russell. All right, man. Take care. Okay, be well. Bye-bye. What a great guy and an awesome guest. I want to thank Mr. Joey Canyon for joining me, and I also want to thank everyone for tuning in to tonight's broadcast of the very first episode of the Russell McLean Show. Hey, be sure and sign up for our newsletter at RadioRandomNetwork.com to keep up with all the updates and everything else that's going to be happening here soon. And with all that said, guys, I think that's my time for tonight. 
Be sure and tune in next Tuesday. I'll be joined by another awesome guest from the entertainment industry, and we'll be talking movies, music, and more right here for the Russell McLean Show. I am Russell Devin McLean. I want to thank our sponsors, Real Estate with Tanya and Jody's Music of Walker, Louisiana. Be sure and check the show notes and description because all the links that were talked about on today's show can be found there. With that said, guys, I'm Russell Devin McLean. Have a great Tuesday night, and we'll talk at you next week.